Mojang has revealed some incredible and insane new features that will be coming in Minecraft 1.21 and also the 2023 mob vote winner. So what's up guys and in today's video I will be giving you a full breakdown of all the new features and stuff that were highlighted in Minecraft Live 2023 so let's get into it. One of the new features that they have talked about was auto crafting. They've also introduced a new block called the crafter which is a block that was powered by redstone where you can craft any item doesn't matter in minecraft automatically by using hoppers it is powered by redstone signals and you can also probably be used in like farms and stuff it is used for like multi-step crafting and it doesn't require any fuel to be used like the furnace the only downside of it is that you can only use one recipe in it. You can also like link them up together and use more than one crafter. So yeah, the auto crafting seems incredibly useful and has been requested for a long time in Minecraft. So yeah, Mojang also introduced the new structure that will be coming called the trial chamber. So the trial chamber is a structure or like dungeon that spawns underground, not exposed. And it can be played and looted multiple times, doesn't matter. So it comes in different sizes and shapes. And it also has a difficulty scale depending on how many players are in the, the chamber. I don't know how that's gonna work, this actually seems kinda interesting. There's also lots of ways you can find loot. There's like decorative pots that you can break which might have loot inside of it. It also comes with a new type of spawner and hostile mob which we'll get into in a few seconds. And also a few new blocks. Hostile mob that spawns in the trial chamber is called the breeze. The breeze is like a wind version of the blaze. It's like related to the blaze. So it shoots like a wind ball that explodes on impact and it has like a really high knockback and the wind ball that it shoots it can also activate redstone sig it, can it can actually act like a redstone signals like you can power this redstone lamp as they showed here and also open trap doors but we don't know what what the mob what it drops yet so that's kind of unknown right now also guys, this is not all the features that are going to be in 1.21, there's, there's still probably a lot more to come. There is also a new type of spawner called the trial spawner that can be found in the trial chamber. When one or more player gets nearby, it will summon like random hostile mobs. Currently, we just know that it, they spawn strays and debris, but it might, there might be more mobs we don't know. Like as I said, the more players that are in the chamber, the difficulty will increase. So yeah, which means that more mobs are going to be spawning from the spawners. When the player players defeat all the mobs that spawn from the trial spawner, the trial spawner will like shoot out loot, random loot like emeralds, diamonds, iron, whatever. It also depends, like if there's like one player in the chamber it will shoot out one pile of loot let's say if there's 10 players in the chamber it will those the spawn will shoot out 10 piles of loot which is actually kind of interesting all we know is that they award you with emeralds and diamonds there might be other stuff as well that we don't know the spawner is also blast proof and it is also pretty hard to mine like obsidian i mean there's no reason to even break it in the first place because it doesn't drop or do anything after it's broken we actually don't know the limit of it yet so yeah there's also new blocks that can be found in the trial chamber so we have new tough bricks tough slabs tough walls tough stairs and i think polished stuff tough that's all we know right now we also have new copper blocks we have like these copper grates which can also be oxidized we also have copper doors, which is all cool. We also have this block over here, and I think that's it's co chiseled copper blocks. And we also have copper trap doors. 
There is also a new light source which is called the copper bulb. Depending on its oxidization level, the light will become dimmer. So if it's at the first stage of oxidation, it will be brighter than the last stage, which is actually kind of cool. Also guys, we might be able to see the copper golem and the tough golem coming. I mean, this is not 100%. Mojang has not revealed. Like, since the trial chambers are made out of tough and copper, we might potentially be seeing the tough golem and the copper golem. Alright guys, moving on to the mob vote winner this this year's mob vote was kind of crazy a lot of drama and controversy even going on about stopping the mob vote well mojang did not stop the mob vote i don't think they'll ever stop it because they're just using it for marketing the mob that won the mob vote was the armadillo a lot of people are saying it was rigged i mean i don't think it was i just think people are just who like really want wolf farmer for some reason i don't know why i mean i guess that's their opinion i mean i guess rip the crab and the penguin we'll never be able to see them maybe i don't know and that's it for today guys i hope you enjoyed have a great day and bye